Hey guys, I'm going to do a quick video for you. This is going to be a video response to my good friend, the farm guy. Uh, he's having a kind of a celebration, celebrating his one year on YouTube. Um, he's having a 10 knife giveaway, the farm guy 10 knife giveaway, just like you say, to celebrate one year of YouTube. And guys, he's got a great channel. He's one of the nicest guys you'll meet here on YouTube. Just a gentleman, runs a very nice, very good channel, very family oriented. Um, lots of good shooting and reviews on all types of firearms. So, if you haven't ever heard of the firearm guy, I'm going to put his link below. Go check him out. Check out his video. See what you think. And um, get in on this contest. He's giving away 10 knives. But, um, just quickly, um, <clears throat> excuse me. He, um, he wanted our thoughts. Um, the kind of premise of this was about ammo. As you can see before you, I've got some ammunition here. This is just some good old Walmart Federal Champion ammo that I shoot a lot of. And some Remington Bolt 22 Long Rifle ammo. But um, he kind of uh, laid the groundwork he was um, referring to um, after the last election or just prior to the last presidential election, how the price of ammo went through the roof and uh, you couldn't find any ammunition. Um, just, you know, it was just like a run on the banks, I guess you could say. People got scared, went out, bought it up uh, as fast as these manufacturers could make it. Um, go to the gun shows. I remember the lines, the, the first gun show I went to after the last presidential election, the line was out. The, I bet I waited an hour, hour and a half in line, maybe longer than that, just to get in the building. And then you could, once you got in, it was so crowded, you couldn't move. Um, uh, people buying up ammo by the cases. Um, so his, that's just kind of what his thoughts are. He wants to know what you're planning um, for the upcoming election. Uh, do you have any different plans this time, seeing how last time we all got kind of got caught with our pants down? And um, especially, um, take a look here, that's a 9mm 380. I had just... I remember trying to find 380 ammunition for my Ruger LCP, and it was impossible. Couldn't find it online. Couldn't find it at any of the gun stores. I I went to, Lord knows how many, um, gun shows, and never ever saw a box of 380 ammo. And if you did find one, it was some obscure, off the wall brand or configuration that uh, they extorted probably three times the price of what it would have originally cost. So. Um, Kind of, that's just kind of what, um, he just kind of wanted our thoughts. And I, I'm one of those people, I shoot a lot. Uh, as you know, I, I, I probably shoot twice a week. But I shoot a lot of this. And every time I go to Walmart, I always try to pick up a box of bulk ammo. Uh, Remington Federal. I don't really like the, the Winchester too much. It doesn't run well in my 22s. But I try to pick up at least a box of 22 every week. And, um, and shoot a lot of 9, a lot of 45, a lot of 40. But, uh. I was just, I just noticed I was in Walmart the other day, um, and they generally keep, you know, the 9mm here in pretty uh, good stock. And I went in there as uh, Grubcat and uh, Ed from the Budget Army Channel one came to shoot at my house a couple weeks ago. And I stopped by the Walmart the day before to get some ammunition, and, and the shelves were picked clean. And that's unusual for mine. I mean, they generally have a good stock, and I talked to the girl, and she said she's noticed already um, people are buying it up as quick as they can put it on the shelf. And, um... I think as we get closer to this election, people are nervous, and I think it's going to get worse. Um, the last gun show I went to, like I say, they're getting the crowds are picking up. They're buying ammo by the case, um, and um, even some of the big manufacturers like uh, Cheaper and Dirt here um, that I buy from, they have some pretty, they run pretty good deals sometimes. But I've noticed they're, especially on some of these bulk bulk buys, they're they're running out of stock. And I don't know. I just think we got the perfect storm coming, guys. Um, with the presidential election, people are nervous about uh, President Obama getting re-elected and um, and what um, you know what his administration may do as far as our gun rights go if the gloves are going to come off if he gets back in because he doesn't have to worry about a re-election or making any one on the right or, or so far angry but um, I think that's where they'll get us I think you know they may let us have all the guns we want all the guns we want much like this uh, my Springfield XD45, one of my favorite, one of my, is this is my bedside gun, but they may let us have all the guns we want, but I think they may get us here on the ammo. I don't know if maybe a, uh, an outrageous tax on ammunition, I've heard stuff like that where it just makes it unaffordable to shoot and enjoy our sport, but um, like I say, with the election coming up, and even, let me show this cheaper and dirty again, even with, they're trying to cash in on some, uh, hype and hysteria check that out the countdown to 12 21 12 273 days four hours 12 minutes and 33 seconds as of this publication so they're 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 kind of taking a jab at the uh 
December 21st, 2012 crowd, uh, uh, implying that the end of the world is soon, you better get your supplies. Um, just nonsense like that. Um, nothing wrong with being prepared and prepping. Um, I try to put back as much as I can. I do shoot a lot, but uh, especially uh, rifle ammunition, I keep quite a bit of 223 and 7.62 by 39. Um, not as not as much handgun as I probably should, but um, like I say, guys, we just got a lot coming up towards the end of this year with the election and um, all the other hype that's going on. So um, that's just my thoughts. I plan to keep on doing what I'm doing right now. I'm just gonna, like I say, I try to at least pick up a box of this once a week and um, I'm gonna look into some bulk buys, um, maybe on some handgun ammunition at the next gun shows or two. But um, <clears throat> anyways, that's just my thoughts and um, get in on the contest. You like to know what your thoughts are. Do you think it's going to be a mad rush? Um, I think it probably will be for a while. I, I can remember, um, like I say, they got Cheaper and Dirt has bulk 223 ammo. Um, uh, the uh, I believe it was the M855 rounds, the SS109 Penetrator, the 62 grain uh, green tips. Uh, they're running about, if they've got them in stock, about 300 and a little over $300 for a box of 1000 But I can remember right shortly after that election where if they had a box, of those they were 999 it was almost a dollar a round so prices went through the roof and i and i'm scared that's probably what's going to happen again be honest with you if uh president obama gets reelected. so uh, anyways guys that's just my thoughts and um brother congratulations on the contest um guys if you hadn't checked out the firearm guy go over and check him out give him a shout and um i appreciate you watching y'all have a good one